हॅलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज चिन्मय देशपांडे इन दिस व्हिडिओ लेक्चर वी आर गोईंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट अ टॉपिक फ्रॉम इंटरपोलेशन नाव टुडे वी विल सॉल्व सम बेसिक प्रॉब्लम रिलेटेड टू इंटरपोलेशन सो हिअर वी विल सॉल्व थ्री न्युमरिकल्स आउट ऑफ विच फर्स्ट न्युमरिकल इज वी हॅव अ डेटा विच इज टू बी गिवन वाय फायू इक्वल टू फोर वाय सिक्स इक्वल टू थ्री मिनिंग इज नथिंग बट वॉट इट इज लाईक दिस वाय ऑफ एक्स इज नथिंग बट युअर व्हॅल्यू ऑफ इफ यू हॅव दिस इज एक्स झिरो देन इट विल बी वाय झिरो मीन वेन एक्स इक्वल टू एक्स झिरो यू हॅव अ व्हॅल्यू वाय इक्वल टू वाय झिरो मिनिंग इज नथिंग बट वेन वी हॅव एक्स इक्वल टू फायव हिअर वी हॅव रिटर्न वी हॅव वाय इक्वल टू फोर लाईक दॅट डेटा हॅज बीन गिवन अँड वी हॅव टू फाइंड इट आउट डेल रेस टू फोर वाय फाय सो वॉट आय विल डू I will just shift this question here so that it will be easy for us and we will solve it here. So this will be your question number one. This data has been given to us. Now here we have to use a forward difference table. So I will write it as here use forward difference table. Now you will ask me, sir, why we are going here for a forward difference table? Because if you carefully observe, we have to find it out del raised to 4 y5. Symbol, this is your del. This is for a forward difference operator. If a symbol is like this, then it will be a backward difference operator. If your symbol is like this, then it will be a central difference operator. Now we have these values, x0, x1, x2, x3, x4. So based on that, now what we have to do? we have to prepare here table so x value and y value so let me write these values 5 6 7 8 9 so x values are 5 6 7 8 and here it will be 9 uh, purposefully here i have uh, i have uh, here i have uh, taken one row okay now here uh, we have y value that is 4 It will be 3, 4, 10, 24. So this is the, these are the values that we have taken from the table. Now we have to find it out. First value, so let me write it as, it will be your del y. So how to find it as? It is very easy. Second value minus first value, 3 minus 4. So it will be what? Okay, let me write it as clearly. 3 minus 4, it will be equal to? minus 1. So this will be your del y0 because we are talking about forward difference operator. If it is x0, this will be y0. So this 0 will be moving here in a further direction. So this will be your del y0. Next is del y1. It will be equal to second value minus first value. That is 4 minus 3. It will be equal to 1. Then del y2, second value minus first value. That is 10 minus 4. So here you will get this answer as a 6 and del y3 which will be equal to second value minus first value that is 24 minus 10 which is equal to 14. I think now you people have understood how I have prepared this column of uh, forward difference table. Next is del square y. So del square y here 0 it will be what? Second value minus first value that is 1 minus of minus 1, 1 minus of minus 1 which will be equal to 2, then this will be del square of y1 will be equal to 6 minus 1, 6 minus 1 which is equal to 5, del square of y2 will be equal to 14 minus 6, so 14 minus 6 will be equal to 8. Now next column we have to prepare which is nothing but del cube of y, so it will be del cube of y0 will be equal to second value minus first value that is 5 minus 2. Okay, so if it is 5 minus 2, so it will be equal to what? 3. Then del cube of y1 will be equal to 8 minus 5. So let me write it as 8 minus 5 as a 3. Okay, and here if you see del raised to 4 y, so how we can write it as? del raised to 4 y0 will be equal to 3 minus 3 which is equal to 0. Now here in a question it is asked to write 
what is del raised to 4 y5 so please see it carefully as it is expected to find it out del raised to 4 so let me write it as del raised to 4 y5 so this value 5 it is denoted as what it is denoted as x0 so let me write it as that is del raised to 4 y of x0 so if you carefully observe it is expected to find it out del raised to 4 of x0 okay so here what is the value of del raised to 4 y of x0 i can write it as del raised to 4 y of 0 because this y of x0 is nothing but your y0 so if you observe carefully in a table we will get this answer as a 0 so this will be equal to 0 del raised to 4 y0 will be equal to 0 now let's see if it is asked let me write it here suppose if i want to find it out del cube of y of uh, let me take it as a 7 del cube of y of 7 then what will be the answer now this question is not mentioned here but additionally i am taking this question now if you see this will be your x1 this will be your x2 now is it possible to have this value no because if you see this is your x2 so this will be your y2 okay so let me write it as how we can write it as del cube of y x2 which is equal to what how i can write del cube of y2 now is it possible is there any term del cube of y2 here no so we cannot give uh, this answer so i can write it as this is not defined we cannot give this answer from the table but if we want to find it out del square of y7 can we find it out yes if you see this 7 is nothing but what it is x2 so how i can write it as it will be del square y of x2 or I, other words i can write it as del square of y2 so what is your del square of y2 we have this answer from a table which is equal to 8 so likewise we have to solve this problem this is one kind of a problem so similarly we will be solving a problem if you see here we will be solving this problem for backward difference table so let me take it here this is your numerical 2 so let me write it as question number 2 now the thing is that we have a value u of 0 equal to 3 u of 1 equal to 12 that is when x equal to 0 we have a value of y or in other words you can take u which is equal to 3 so likewise we have this data and we have to find it out del raised to 4 y u 4 now as here this symbol is like this so which table we have to use correct here we have to use backward difference table so let me write it as we have to prepare first backward difference table so how to prepare a backward difference table let me write it as now instead of u i will say here as a okay or you can write it as u also y also that depends on you what to be right here so we have these values 0 1 2 3 4 so i will write it as 0 1 2 3 and here it will be a 4 and corresponding u values it is there in a table 3 12 81 then 2000 and we have this 100 value so as we have to do here backward difference table so it will be what del u will be equal to what second value minus first value so 12 minus 3 which will be equal to 9 here del u second minus first value 81 minus 12 which will be equal to 69 then here again del u which is equal to second minus first that is 2000 minus 81 which will be equal to if you do it on a calculator you will get it as 1919 and here del u 100 minus 2000 so you will get this answer as minus 1900 now you will ask me sir here we haven't written any kind of suffixes so we will write it here if you start here from x0 this will be your y, u0 or you can say y0 so this is your x1 this is your x2 x3 so this is your x4 so this will be your u4 
So here, as it is backward, so we have to write here 4, then 3, then 2, then 1. So these are the suffixes that we have written. After that, next is the thing but what? Del square of u. So how to write it as? Del square of u will be equal to second minus first value. So 69 minus 9 is 60. Now I am going to write directly answer. Then del square u second minus first value. 1919 minus 69. So you will get answer as 1850. And next is del square u second minus this uh, first value. So minus 1900 minus 1919. So it will be minus 3819. So let me complete this table first. Okay, and here again if you see this 4 as it is a backward. So here we have read here it is as 4. So it will be 3. So here it will be 2. And uh, next thing if you see, uh, next is nothing but del cube of u. So how to find it out del cube? So let me write it as del cube of u will be equal to second minus first value. 1850 minus 60, it will be 1790. Similarly, here you will get answer of del cube of u, it will be minus 3819 minus 1850, so it will be minus 5669. So again, here suffix will be 4, here suffix will be 3. Okay, and after that, okay, let me complete this table here. After that, we will be writing it for del raised to 4 u so it will be what del raised to 4 u of 4 because what obvious this value will be here so my second value minus first value minus 5669 minus 1790 so you will get this as minus 7459 so likewise here we have prepared this table now thing is that we have to find it out answer for del raised to 4 y of u of 4 so what we have to find it out, del raised to 4, u of 4. So this 4 value, it is denoted by what? x4. So I can write it as del raised to 4, x of 4. Okay. Or yes, in, a, in this way also we can write it. Or you can write it as del raised to 4, u4. So is there any term which indicates del raised to 4, u4? Yes, it is there. If you see, this will be what? This will be your minus 7459. Here you, you will get this answer. Okay. Now suppose in this question only suppose uh, if anybody has asked uh, value of del square u3 then how to find it out. It is very easy. Here 3 means what? It is denoted by x3. So it will be what? Del square x of 3. x of 3 is also uh, written as y3. So is there a term del square y3? Yes, del square y3 or you can say del square u3 instead of y. Here I will be writing it as a u. So yes, we have this del square u3 which is equal to 1850. So likewise, 4 marks or uh, uh, 5 mark questions we 